Big shot, picked it up. Welcomes Kamran Khan in the final over with a biggie. Dipindra Singh Airi is certainly making it count on this occasion in the final over of this innings. Well, a really strange choice here, I have to say, for Qatar. They've gone to their part-timer. He filled in okay for the four remaining deliveries of that 18th over, but surely you turn to Ikramullah or Mohammad Irshad here, who both have overs left. Instead, they go to the part timer. Dependra Singh Iri it is again. He cashes in. This time, wide off the crease, and what a strike and a half that is from Dependra Singh Iri. The ball nearly sailing halfway towards the main street out at the Oman Cricket Academy. Dependra Singh Iri on fire. Well, the Tigers roaring yet again. There's a reason he's a fan favourite. He's the original, the full three-dimensional cricketer. You cannot give him width. Qatar are simply not learning. And right now, this innings is turning into the best of the lot from Nepal. 40 off 17. It's driving them up towards 200. Still four deliveries left. This time shot once again and treated in a similar fashion. Dipinder Singh Airi is not letting this one go. He's going to make Kamran... Just pay for the, those poor deliveries, the poor choice of deliveries that he's planning to deliver. Well, shades of Jasker and Malhotra at this very venue. It was back in 2021, the American became the fourth international cricketer to hit six sixes in an over. That was off a part-time medium pacer in the final over of an ODI against Papua New Guinea. And now it's this man. It's the Tiger himself. It's Dependra Singh Iri. He's gone bang, bang, bang. Can he repeat the dose? Can he make three sixes six? Can he finish with the maximum allotment? Nepal are thinking of 200 plus and it's all thanks to this man. Full this time around. The ball is sailing. The ball is sailing. And yes, mate, that's another six off the bat of Dipinder Singh. Airi brings up his 50 in quick time here. 19 deliveries to be precise. And what a strike. Are we witnessing something extremely special at the Oman Cricket Academy? Well, a 19 ball 50. It's been world-class ball striking. Look at the hands. Look at the speed. Look at the quality of ball connection from Dependra Singh Iri. It's a ninth T20 international 50 strike rate escalating, flying up towards 300. Oh, Iri, you're on the brink of something special here. Two more balls. Can Cameron can find an answer? Big shot. Picked it up towards the onside this time around. Nearly on to oval number two at the Oman Cricket Academy. Five sixes. Dependra Singh Iri is on fire here at the Oman Cricket Academy. Well, he's a rock star. He really is one of a kind, Dependra Singh Iri. Five in a row. You just sensed something was brewing after three of them. There's only four cricketers to have done it. Herschel Gibbs, Yuvraj Singh, Kyron Pollard and Jaskaran Malhotra at this venue. You just need one more, Tiger. Can you do it? Here's your moment. Full, and of course he goes aerial, he goes long, he goes big. Dipendra Singh Ayri makes it six in a row. Six sixes on the very last over of this innings. Nepal are going back into the dugout with a thunderous, thunderous performance in the last quarter of this batting innings. Well, you little beauty, Dipendra Singh Ayri. You've made history. Add your name to the list. There's only five men in that club. Yuvraj Singh, you can join Herschel Gibbs, you can join Kyron Pollard, Jaskaran Malhotra. It's the first ground in the world to have it done twice. Moments they'll never forget. Dependra Singh Iri, six of the very best. Sensational ball striking, the highest quality from Nepal's superstar. Stunning, absolutely stunning. The second time I've seen it live here with my own eyes here at this venue. These fans won't forget it. Malhotra the last, Dependra Singh Ayri the next. And with a T20 World Cup to come, who knows, it might go once more this year.